What you guys got another video here for you now if you're like me I use control panel all the time but in the latest update from Windows 10 they've removed control panel from the right click menu here and they've just left settings you to move over and start to use the settings pane more than the control panel uh, pane because the control panel is old and they want you to get away from it but personally you can't just tell someone to stop doing something after they've been doing it for so many years because since early times the control panel's always been there and now they suddenly want to remove that from your uh, menu here and make you use the settings pane. Now it can be a bit of a, a nightmare to keep typing that in there to bring up control panel and you can put shortcuts everywhere but I don't want to do that I want to add it back to where I like using it so to do that I can show you where the location is I'm going to go to this PC and if we type here percentage vocal app data and then percentage and then push enter here it will give us access to this area here so from here we want to go into Microsoft Windows and then down to the bottom where it says WinX this is where you've got group 1, 2 and 3. Inside group 2 is where your control panel is and this is where it's opened up as you can see here. The problem is they've called it control panel and uh, to change this out you would have to copy the old control panel and put it in here. But there is a, another way of doing it uh, with some software and I'll show you how to do that. Now if you're interested in the software, I will leave the link in the video description. It's called Win Plus X. You've seen me use this uh, software before, and this is it here. So let me just quickly open it up. I've got it here on my desktop. It's just a simple little program. I'm gonna click on this and open it up. And now you can see it gives us access to these groups here. So you don't have to type anything out. You could just come straight in here, and we're looking at group two. As you can see, we've got control panel. They've named control panel here for this settings. This is what it's linked to. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna rename this, right click on it, rename, and I'm gonna call this settings because that's exactly what it is. Name that settings. Now all we need to do is go to the group two, group two uh, area here. Go up to add a program. You can see uh, add a program here, and you can also see add control panel items. So if we click on add control panel items, and inside here you can see we can now add in control panel items, or we can add in whatever we like here. So I'm going to add in control panel click on select and you see now control panels dropped in there and that's nice so we've got settings here and control panel the reason why I renamed it because I don't want it to conflict with this one here and uh, all we need to do now is click on restart Explorer and when we click on our right click hey presto we got our control panel back and of course, we get the best of both worlds because we still got access to our settings. And that's pretty much it. Super quick fix uh, to bring back your control panel using uh, WinX menu editor. It's pretty straightforward and easy to do, guys. But it can be frustrating if you're used to using control panel and they've suddenly removed that. Anyway, I hope this one helps you out, guys. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, you can go to my main YouTube channel here click on the red subscribe button and also what's really important is hit that bell notification button and this will notify you when I upload new videos. Thanks again for watching, have a great weekend, bye for now.